Hello everyone, welcome back to a new episode of Cassette Beast. Last time we left off, we got our ass kicked by a crazy critter, but I got this ability to dash, which is cool. Um, it would have been a lot easier if I had the ability to um, do, the com do the combining thing, the fusion, but unfortunately I can only do that with Kaylee now. Maybe if I sit down and talk with Eugene. Maybe. Eugene discusses with you the differences between your two worlds. No. Okay, I guess I gotta do a little bit more with Eugene before I'm ready to... to fuse with him. Uh... So let's just, uh... go ahead and hop out of here. Sorry, Eugene. Hello. Take Kaylee? What? Yes. Let's go! Awesome. So, take a quick break, and let's check out the party. So you bring, uh... Sirenade back with you. Cool. So... You can go there. So do I... do I just completely lose? Yeah, I do just completely lose, um... Eugene's Cassette Beast. Which makes sense. Alright. Well, I'll roll with what we got here. And... I think we should go back over there and try to refight that thing now. God, that thing is so loud sometimes, I swear. Alright, so yeah, I wanna get back... up there. We'll see what else we can- Oh, hey, here's one! Hello. Will you challenge this rogue fusion? Yeah. It'll be a lot easier. Spring rattle? Okay, so now I can fuse. I couldn't do that with, um, with what's-his-face, so this will maybe make my life a little bit easier. Um, is there anybody I would want to switch to? Hopskin, Woltergeist? No, I think we want to stick with you. So, let's take out the Carnaviper first. Um, and let's go ahead and set up an air wall. Ow. Pain. Ow. Also pain. And now I'm poisoned. There we go. So, three free hits, thanks to that air wall. Air wall seems incredibly strong, so... Um... Let's, uh... Wallop you. And... Call for help. 50% chance to summon an ally. I don't think I'm gonna do that, though. That's fine. God, that clobber attack is incredibly scary. Okay, our air wall is gone, but that helped a lot, I think. All right, spring rattle. Yeah, you're only level 14, so you're much more manageable. Now let's go ahead and fuse. Pausing Kaylee's heart attack is one. Wingnade. Love when the music kicks in. All right, so what do we want to use? Probably a Zephyr? I think, um, our attack there would be higher. Ow. That's good damage, that's good damage. Um, we should probably use a rewind here. Wing Loom. There we go. Oh, and that heals me to full. Interesting. Just using it on one of them heals me to full. I thought it was gonna heal me like halfway, and then I was gonna have to refill again. Seems like that's not the case, though. God, this music's good. That clobber is so scary, though. Um, hit him with another Zephyr. That heals you, right? Ugh. Annoying. You can't afford clobber again. Oh, now you can. Use another rewind. Luckily, I have the heals required for this. Alright, we're actually gonna be able to defeat one, my god. Multi-smack. Ow, ow, ow. Eat it, nerd! Oh my god, we won. Ooh! Masquerade. Ooh, you look cool. Uh, hold the phone. Sonic Boom? I- I don't think this will kill them, so... Yeah, no, they're still alive. Um, unfuse. There we go. And I want to record... 
um, mask a rattle because you're new. So that's what it means by allows you to, to find some rare cassette beasts because sometimes the thing that the uh, fusion is fused with is rare. Well, that's cool. 24%. Multi smack. Owie. 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 Pain. Oh my god, you know Clobber? Jesus! Recording failed. Okay. God, that spring heal is scary. Okay. Well, uh, I'm gonna try and record again. Use on the mask rattle. And you drop a pustule bomb? Okay. So we should be fine this time? God, that spring heal. And you're multi-smacking me. God. Act faster, Kaylee. Thank you. There we go. All right. It's poisons. It's my my chance for catching it went up a fair bit there. My recording failed. Uh. Well, we gotta we gotta just keep trying, I suppose. It's gonna die if I don't throw something on it right now. So that's beast and lightning is what I have. Oh, this is my last basic tape. Shit. Um... Hmm... It's gonna die if I didn't try to catch it here. And I want it, it seems rare. 27% chance... You spit... Okay, good. On them. 30% chance... 42? Thank you. Oh my god, that was my last regular tape. Mask rattle. It is often presumed that mask rattles use the face-like armor plates on their heads to lure in unsuspecting prey. This is a myth. The faces on their heads are actually very creepy and couldn't possibly convince anyone to approach them. <laughs> okay, so you're the evolution to Carnaviper, right? If I had to guess. Yeah, you're very fast and you have high attack stats. You're pretty good. And your stickers? Chance to automatically use when hit with the melee attack, sharpen, bite, multi-smack. Those are strong. This is a strong, uh, this is a strong beast here. That's correct, let's put in storage. Having two poison types might be a bad idea, but... That thing seems wildly strong. Ooh, we got fused material for that. Uh, double slice rare hits- finally we got a better move for you, Hopskin. Um, so, power 30 hits twice, hits each member of a team multiple times. Critical hit on type advantage, 20% accuracy and 44% chance of that. Okay, cool. These are good things. God, I immediately need to go back to town now, though, and heal. Okay, well that was- that was a good get, though. I'm glad we ran into that. Cause that means, uh, that means good stuff. Alright, so let's go in here and rest. Thank you, Kaylee. We- we defeated that thing. Hmm. That Archangel we fought. Morgant, right? Didn't really defeat her alone, did we? Someone had already wounded her when we found her. Even in her weakened state, she seemed so dangerous. Whoever wounded her must have been absolutely savage. Hadn't considered that. Makes me feel like us humans are pretty puny in comparison. Mm-hmm. Broken tapes have been repaired, yay! Um, let's go get Eugene back now. I just wanted to defeat one of those things, basically. So... Um, now that we've defeated one, I'll put Kaylee back. I didn't expect to run into one so quickly there. Take storage, so... This thing just seems so strong. I feel like I want to bring it just because of that. Like, let's see, who would I want to take out of the party, though? Winggloom, maybe? Let's- let's put- let's put Winggloom away. Let's put Winggloom away. I'm not that crazy about Winggloom. Having two of the same type, bad idea, yes, but... It seems very, very strong at the moment, so... Let's add you to the party. Hmm. 
Professor Hoylake says he's looking for a new research assistant. He's usually hanging around the town hall. How he manages to research monsters while completely avoiding them, I'll never know. Uh, assistant wanted. Okay. You can do that. I totally flubbed the lyrics in this song. I just know this song's good. Okay, so... It was right here, yeah, so... Put your ranger training. Cool. Professor Hoylick. Hi. Something on your mind? Let's use the material? Rogue fusions drop it, maybe archangels do too. Not sure. So why we're asking rangers to collect it. Well, let the captains worry about that. Just focus on passing your training. Hi. Uh, elemental types? And paying attention to the elemental types. Elemental moves can cause chemical reactions when used against monsters of certain types. These reactions can be beneficial for you, for example. Using a fire move on a poisoned elemental target will cause them to burn. Remember that same fire move when used on a water monster will surround them with a healing steam. Not so good, huh? You can always see what a status effect your attack is going to cause before you trigger it, so stay uh -oh. observant. I forgot, a lot of moves such as smack and spit don't have an innate element themselves. They will instead depend on whatever element their user is. Yeah. Hello. What are you after? Bye. Ta -ta. Okay, so this is the place I should be going for this quest, right? Yeah, you're up there. Up there, you're who I need to talk to. Greetings and salutations. Newcomer, I am Professor Percival Hoylake, intrepid investigator into the unknown. The unknown? Yes. Indeed, as we all find ourselves marooned in this curious realm, it falls upon a steadfast and rational mind to make sense of the chaos that surrounds us. I am talking of the scientific method. We must observe, analyze, and form conclusions. Hmm. The humble townsfolk describe many strange beasts on this island. If we were to catalog them, then the unknown would cease to be unknown. Say, you look like the apprentice in, uh, appreciate the importance of this task. Would you be interested in helping me identify some monsters? Yeah, give me the Pokédex. Excellent. Wonderful. I have some descriptions of monsters I've sourced from Harbor Town's populace. If you can record these monster forms, I'll be able to catalog them. First account I have is a fanged creature perched on a skull spotted in the park. Here are some blank tapes to assist in your research. Ooh, thank you. <laughs> Come on by when you've recorded it and I shall catalog it. Happy hunting. Record a fanged creature perched on a skull. Often spotted in the park. Okay. I will do that. What is this? It's box planter. Nothing's been planted here yet. Okay, so let's, uh, let's get back out there, I guess. I see no reason not to. So I could make my way back to that thing and try to fight it again with Eugene now, because I do have more heals. Oh, speaking of, we should refill. We should refill. I kind of wish I still had my run a little bit. It wasn't amazing, but it didn't make that really loud sound also? when I used it. Uh, it's on the menu. I would like... Rewind. Two of them. Um... It's two additional AP uses up a turn during combat. Smoke bomb, anti deodorant. I'll get some more of these. Au revoir. Au revoir. Because I just like having a lot of them. So, yeah, let's. Uh, I guess make our way back down there. I want to explore some more of that place. So we were over there, and we we can get there pretty quickly now. Now that I have this. Oh yeah, also, there was a chest over there I can get now, because this Bulletino ability allows me to, like, run through... Um... Like, wind currents, right? From what I recall? So we can use that to our advantage. So do the, the fused monsters, do they only show up at night? I'm thinking so, right? I'm thinking that's the case. Well, at least I have Carnaviper and its evolution now. Yee yee yee. Oh, there's another one. Or when it's raining. We challenge the fusion swarm. Is that multiple? Fusion swarm carnivipper horde? Interesting. Uh well, um, I'm gonna wanna build up for a double slice, so let's make one of those. Do that. Um, raise arms, raise the user's range attack. We'll do that. There we go. Hey, you. Ooh, nice crit. Okay. Ow. Pain. 
Okay, well, maybe I overprepared for this. Oh, wait, no, more of them joined the fight. Okay, well, um, that's something we're gonna have to work on. Okay, so yeah, I did say it was a swarm. I was wondering if that was gonna be the case. Um... Each member of the party multiple times. Let's, uh, let's just do smacks. I'm pretty sure I'll be able to kill most of them with that. Especially with Eugene, since he has the higher attack right now. God, they're spitting so hard at me. There we go, 60. Enemy- Ooh, there's a Masquerattle! Okay, let's switch off of- Actually, no, let's not switch off of you, because I want a double slice. It would be so cool to get a double slice off. Let's use uh, a rewind on you. Op skin. There you go. Boom. Good stuff. There we go. That's what I was building up for. Enemy Masky Viper. Okay, this is the other option that it can evolve into, I suppose. Uh, I can't record it. That's unfortunate. I was really hoping I would be able to record it. Um, just toy hammer it. Toxic stab. Oh my god! Okay. And it has revenge strike. Good crit, Eugene. That was very, very nice. Um... I'll get my own- my own snack out here. Yeah, maybe this is a three-tier evolution and that's the final form. Honestly, I think the final form looks a little bit dumb, but, uh... Whatever. I prefer the first and second forms. Owie. God, it hits like a truck, though. Okay, okay, that was just those two fused. I see. I didn't realize you could fuse with your pre-evolution. That's kind of wild. Huh. You can fuse with your own pre-evolution. Weird. Okay, so no, Masquerattle probably is the- is the form. Oh wait, Astral, you're gonna get messed up here. You're absolutely gonna get messed up here. Let's kill the Carnaviper, and you multi-smack the Masquerattle. Good stuff. Yeah, you can fuse with your pre-evolution. Wild. I mean, I guess it makes sense. I just didn't think that was going to be an option, really. Huh. Alrighty. Victory! There we go. More fused material. Smells strongly of rotten eggs. My hop skip is down. Uh, and Cloxley is down as well. Or hop skin, not hop skip. The hell am I talking about? Okay, we need to avoid those things if we see any more of them for now. For sure. Alright, but there's stuff I can do over here that I would like to do. Deadlands. Leave me alone. Oh, I ran right straight into you. Okay, well, uh, shooting star. And... Leech, I guess? That's not gonna kill you. I will leech you. Doesn't matter if I'm poisoned, because I'm just gonna suck your HP. Boom. There we go. Bow, bow, wow. Do, 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 do. Alright, we're good there. Leave me alone, please. Southern Isles. Yeah, this is where I was when I saw that thing that one time. So is this all that's over here, really? I guess so. Mm. We're having an out-of-body experience, yep. Weird. Is that a hint of something that can happen? I can get grabbed by something? Oh, leave me alone! Can I just run away from you, actually? Hopefully. Yeah, there we go. I do have repels, but I'm like, I want to save them for right now. So, that chest... Did I already get that chest? Thought I did, right? Oh wait, no, I couldn't- I couldn't reach it, that's right. I remember now. 
I couldn't get up there, figure out how to get up there, rather. Yeah, because I needed to be able to run through that. There we go. Plastic. Brick Blast Uncommon. Plus 11% accuracy per slot. Ooh, and a basic tape. No, you don't. Okay, what's through here? Can I, like, cr like smash through these? I can! Okay. Yeah, that rock has cracks running all the way through it. You can break that thing wide open with a dash. Cool. Now I know. Yep. Good to know. Oh, God. Muskrat Viper? <laughs> Not enthused about this. Um... Hmm. Raises my melee attack. Uh... I think I want to switch off of you. Get Masquerattle in here. You leech the thing. It's gonna poison you, but... Ow! Oh my god. They're so scary, these fused... things. Oh my god, they're so scary. Multi-hit. I am attacking it with something it's not good against. But, Snooze Spore gives the target sleep stats for three turns. That would be quite amazing. Um... If you can get it off before you die, you cannot. Holy. Okay, at least you're still leeched. Okay, that's good, that's good. Revenge strike, that's fine. We're still, we're still going. Pom bomb? Alright, Eugene. Um, a multi smack again. And you use. I'm kind of worried. Dog ears. Who's the duration of the target status effects? Ooh, that's good. Oh wait, no, 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 never mind. Wait, can I use it on enemies? Oh, I can use it on enemies. Okay, good, good, good. That's what that's what I wanted to use. Good. So use it on Muskrat Viper. If this doesn't kill me, it barely did not. Now I extend the the length of your status effects, which will be very helpful. Boom, boom, boom. Revenge strike, there it is again, god. Dog ears, yes. Timer's extended, good. You died to the poison, but that's fine. Woltergeist, get in here. I think we're barely gonna be able to beat this thing? I kinda want the muskrat viper, though. The, the muskrat thing that it turns into, basically. Um, elemental wall. Ow, we're disturbed and poisoned. Okay, it's down, it's down. Good, oh my god, look at it! Muskrat a tear! Oh, it's so adorable! Oh, it's so cute! Oh, I love it. Um, okay, I need to multi smack the Carna Viper, and you need to rewind yourself. Badly. Okay. This should kill the Carna Viper? Yes! Alright. Now now it's just the Muskrat here. Oh no, what if the leech kills it? Oh, okay, no, no, we're good, we're good. Record! Um, actually no. I'm going to multi-smack. And you are going to record. With this. Is it a beast? It is a beast. I can catch it with the faux fur tape. There we go. Recording! Recording! 100% chance! Yeah! Boom. Oh yeah, we got it. We got it, Eugene. Muskrat... Muskratier! Oh god, you killed oh, it! Man. Damn it. But you can just attack me! Damn! That's hard. That makes it hard. Uh, I'm sure I'll be able to find one again. <sighs> Damn, you gotta survive until the end of the turn, though, with your character just sitting out there. I mean, I won, I just didn't get the muskrat. Nurse. Heal one target for 50% of their max HP, that's pretty good. Lowers the target speed. That's unfortunate. I mean, I got a fused material and a water tape. These are, there are two buttons on the side that allow you to play a ring toss game while you're not using it. It has a very high efficiency rate. Used in a window? 
Oh, no, window. Allow ranged attack to hit the target through walls? What? Oh, oh, you mean the walls they summon. Okay, never mind. Yeah, yeah, that makes sense. Okay. Back to town, I guess. Oh my god. We keep getting our ass kicked and have to go back to town. <laughs> oh, it's it's difficult, it is. Ugh. Let's take a quick break. I was so close to getting that muskrat. I need to work on my battle shouts. Yeah, your barks. Your what? Yeah. yeah, like when I'm facing down some foes and just before I transform, I yell something like, Let's do this, or transform! You can do better than those. Uh... It's an ongoing project, okay? What if I shouted I'm going monster mode? Would that work? You think that sounds badass? Uh, what, what about, what about, oh god, he's gonna morb. Uh, absolutely not. Not at all. Come back to it another time, then. Alright, my broken tapes have been repaired. Oh. God, those things do not mess around. Huh, I would like to actually get some, like, progress stuff done today. Um, you know what, let's explore some more town, because I don't have much more <laughs> time left in this video, so we might as well get a little bit- Oh yeah, I can't go across the bridge, though. Um, let's see. And yeah, there's nothing down here. I guess I gotta leave through the, uh, the northern part to get over there. Yeah, because we need to get over there and lower the bridge, for sure. I wonder if I can fly to that barrel? No. I was like, can I land on the barrel and be good? No. The answer is no. Alright, well, let's just, uh, get out and explore town. We can- we can go, like, up and then to the left. We've never really been over there before, so... What do you have? Hey. Did you manage to find that wood? Uh, 300 wood? <laughs> you did it! Thanks for your help! I was dreading the thought of collecting all those materials mm. myself. Mm. Since you helped me out, why don't you decide on the design? Sign should feature an emblem that really sums up Harbor Town. What do you think? A bird? A flower? A- probably a dolphin. Hmm. Alright, let's go with that. Cool. Yay! Oh. Ew. Well done, what do you think? I love it! <laughs> nice work, man. I've been my whole life here, but a lot of folks come from different places and get stuck here. This makes them feel even a little bit better when they see it, and it was worth the effort, I think. Yay. Moved from inventory, that cost me 300 wood, but... Oh, wow, we get XP for it, though. AP steel? Steals one AP from the target? Copper chop. Hits one target, inflicts resonance on glass and metal type targets. Interesting. And you learned elemental wall. We also got some fused material. Okay, wait, we got a lot of stuff. Copper chop seems neat. That's neato. Okay, and it's another type of attack for Hopskin, basically, which I feel Hopskin really, really needs. Okay, we are not fighting any more fused thingies. It's way easier to get that stuff than I thought it was going to be, the fused material. You can get it quite fast. Nope. Not doing it. But, that rock has cracks running all the way through it. Yeah. Uh, parry stance. Reflects the first melee attack received this round. Interesting. So yeah, now we can get through all of these things. I couldn't get through here before. Cool, cool. I'm glad we got that dash. Aha! And this gets me back into Harbor Town here, except from this way. Cool. So, let's see if we can progress a little bit more this way. Things are sounding very sinister over here. What is that Carna Viper doing up there? How in the world? Okay, and this is still the side of town we've actually been to. Ah, but I can get through this. <laughs> yeah! I made it! Loading the rest of the world. Cool! We're, we're to the other side now. Awesome. Oh, there's one of those land keepers down there. Hello! Hey, come back here. A lot of newcomers in town go through a difficult period. If I had any advice for you, it'd be to embrace your new life here. Doesn't mean you should also forget the life you used to have, though. You're as much, uh, uh, you're as much your past as your future, you know. Okay. 
Ooh, a shiny. Or not a shiny, but a bootleg. Sorry about the traffic crab, that's just my son. He loves playing with his bootleg tape. Bootleg? Yeah, have you ever seen a monster near uh, travels that isn't its normal color? That's a bootleg. Don't confuse it with a coating. Bootleg monsters permanently have different colors, different elemental types, and different moves than usual. And when you record them, they keep those attributes. Recorded bootlegs have a higher rate of producing uncommon and rare moves, so they can be very useful. Why don't you take this and see for yourself? Captain Cody gives me a spear, so I have plenty already. I got a... Salamagus? Slippery Salamagus is a student of pyromancy and other arcane arts. It is able to breathe fire using fuel it stores in the pouches on its head. Incidentally, these look like giant googly eyes to the untrained eye. <laughs> okay, those are pouches. It looks like giant googly eyes. So you're a metal, Salamagus. Okay, you seem cool. Alright. Alright, yeah, you seem, you seem fine. What do we have that I could give you? I could give you Clobber. But you're your ranged attacker. Airy stance, superheated fist, window. Okay. That's that's that seems fine. Salamagus was put in storage. Bootleg -like monsters can appear anywhere at random, but apparently they're more often seen in fusions. Heard that some very rare bootleg -like monsters sparkle and shine as if they're all covered in glitter. Okay, so shinies are in the game. Interesting. So now the color traffic crab. Yep. So there was our bootleg tutorial if I hadn't already ran into the things way earlier. Neato. What's in here? Hey, what's up? <gasps> Life in hard times is peaceful, but I miss city life. Commuting on hot trains, buying expensive lunch from a supermarket, losing most of my wages to rent. Those truly were the days. Ew. Were they? I don't think they were. All right, let's lower the bridge, if possible. There's buttons there to do it, it looks like. Oh, it's Eugene's place! Oh, this is where you live! Yeah, this is my place, Eugene HQ, the pad, my base of operations. Okay. I was hoping I could run into your punching bag and, and do something to it. There we go! Yay, we opened the bridge! Cool, cool. ba bum. Awesome. Well, I think with that, we'll probably go ahead and end this episode off here, because I still got to get this up today. But, hope you've enjoyed, and I'll see you next time for some more.